Hey everyone. Uh, the pub. Yep. <coughs> Voice is a bit effed, so we have to watch that. Um, I've kind of fallen out of love with this game, so I'm hoping playing today will help me get back on track. I just need to make sure my mic is working. Yeah, it looks it. Yeah, so um, this is the center map. It's now I have explored that much of it. <laughs> uh, I'm still not well, so I'm not really getting a chance to play much games. But, um, ow. So basically, <clears throat> I've set up a server. Everyone's on it, but Natrado being Natrado, loads of issues. So we may have some crashes playing the game. Um, but other than that, I mean, I'm trying to think what I need to do. This was a very quick starter piece. Um, very basic. And I've actually got a base. Um, where's my base? Can I, I can't see me on that one. Got my voice. <laughs> Should have thought of this first before jumping on live. Um, see how many times I've died. Right, plant has built a base. You know the little river that goes around here. I don't know why this bit's blocked off because I've ran up and down this. I've actually sailed this as well. I haven't had an energy drink in about three months. Um, I have built roughly here with the Parasaurus. So I've got like a, a base there. But there's not much to tame. So I don't know why I built there. It was just on, on my plant stream the other night. And you can see I've been dying a lot. I'm not really bothered. A um, whole lot of the map I need to explore. So... I could probably do with a flyer, but I really haven't got much, ooh, my shops, right, much in the way of resources to actually get going. I have started the game from scratch, <coughs> excuse me, but I let other people bring their characters over from the other maps that we've been running on the server. Cooked prime meat. Cheeky bastard. Um, right. We'll ignore him. Oh, green drop. Let's see what's in this, because I haven't heard a drop yet. This is my disgusting fat character. A pile of weight on while I've been sick, so I thought, you know what? <laughs> like real life match, although um, I'm a lot taller in reality. You know, I'm running, I'm not even looking at what I'm running into. What level are you? Do the crystal because I haven't seen any of that. I might not be able to. Do you know, let's grab it all. And then. Oh, no. Yeah. Alright, we'll get him. I don't really need him. I've got one up top, I just saw. I don't actually have a, a thing put. I've just picked all this crap up. And now I'm too heavy. I don't even know what I need wool for. I do need that, so I should be able now. Let's see. Can I make a spyglass? No, because I haven't unlocked it. I was gifted one by a tribe mate. And then plant mix came and rubbed it off me. It's a weird noise, isn't it? So a lot of people have been complaining about this game lately. Um, they're annoying people and... 
I pretty much have a love hate game with it, with it, a love hate relationship with it at the minute because I don't know. I just I don't like the direction they're taking with all the stuff, um, especially the DLC gear. Uh, I've seen the videos where they're saying how. Um, I need to drop something else. Let's drop. There we go. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Um, so I saw a lot of complaints about the the way this this map looks. You know, it's just hi. I, I can't read that. So you is that? Um, OBS has got death. Oh, you death. Sorry, my, my eyesight is shocking now, and your name is popping up in like the worst text ever to read on OBS. <laughs> um, right, I'm gonna tame this, so let's throw all of this in here because it can carry it for me. Um, yeah, so people were saying that like the design of this game isn't that good, you know, they've come from like unique stuff to kinds of more generic um, elements which is a bit of a shame uh, yeah I, um, I I had the COVID well I wasn't going to get a, they keep asking me to get a COVID jab because you know I'm autoimmune and I wasn't going to but obviously with everything going on with me eye and you know the diagnosis I thought yeah I'll get it I have been so sick of it. It's ridiculous. Um, I, I never get... I, I've had this be fourth or fifth one. I've never been sick of them. Felt like I had COVID. My arm is still dead. <laughs> it's so sore. But... Um, quick shower and I felt a bit better today. Um, but yes, yeah, so I've, I've been seeing the complaints about this. I am never going to buy anything on this game, DLC-wise. They can fuck off. You know what I mean? I, I watched Ras Clark before, and he said, the game is your revenue source, one, because everyone had to buy the game again, even though it was supposed to be free. Free. Then, um, what did they do next? They brought out premium paid mods. That's resource two. Premium paid mods, which is fair enough because the modders, you know, they're doing all this work and pay them because some of the mods are great. The servers to them better at least. Yeah, I'm hoping it's fine. It'd be interesting when everyone jumps on after death to see how it works there. So we have two resource revenue streams for them. Then they come up with the Frontier Tales. We're in early access, by the way. So the Frontier Tales is story maps. 15 quid or whatever it was and it's for scorched aberration and extinction so you're buying something you don't know what you're getting in the future three revenue streams now they're selling single single creatures four revenue streams for a game that's in early access and people are, are stopping playing because they're fed up the break in the game and all that so i don't know i, I gave up conan exiles because they brought out a battle pass and I loved that game. And I thought I'm paying more stuff. They've had the money off me. And I bought the Isle of Sipta for that. So, and I bought on the PlayStation, I bought, um, I had the season pass, the, the, uh, the first one. So, but I'm thinking, you know, if they want us to pay money, I might go back to Conan, see how that's getting on. But anyway, oh, right, while I'm here now, there's metal around here, so I kind of need some resources. Shit, that's an alpha. Well, there's an alpha raptor over there, so resources or not, let's head back home. So how are you finding it, Death? Are you enjoying the centre? Because you've been on it more than anyone, I think. I didn't miss that. Hmm. 
Yeah, it's still going. Don't know if it's me, it just seems blurry. It's a nice map, you like it? That's good. As long as you're enjoying it, I think that's the key, isn't it? But, um... I'm still getting, I'm getting like 40 frames on here now. I had a try and it died. Uh, what level are you? 168. I don't think I've got enough arrows. All right, let's um, let's get some more hides and get a, a saddle for him. And uh, we'll just get some resources here. I think I'm stuck on this island for now. <laughs> I mean, I could make a raft. Dump the stuff in here for now. Wool is always so heavy, isn't it? I was playing first time you actually trapped up in this game so that also helps that I'm not feeling overly bored with grinding I thought you were in a tribe with Lee don't you always tribe with Lee what I don't like it in a tribe tribes are good but when you come on and they've done everything so like I've got I've got five dinos. These two, I only have these because I carry around ma major berries with me. You tried to waffle. Uh, um, just in case these little fuckers attack me. So it just tames them. Uh, but I have two parasols and a moss shop. Uh, the tribe so far has 22, which isn't too bad, I suppose. Uh, but I don't know if Leo plants have got the cryopod set up yet. See what? There's lots of obby raptors, isn't it? Right, let's run around. Let's kill a few things, get some hide. So you've got all of the artifacts now, haven't you, I think? I mean, the game's been out late. Like, has it been out a week yet? Right, I need AC hide. Most of the last dinos are probably in cryopods, yeah. So this is not modded this server. It is boosted, but not majorly, just for like things like um, breathing and stuff like that and taming. Because who's got time to like piss about? Um, I, I haven't been able to figure out how to do the, um, the pride colors yet. So I'm not sure. It says launch items. So launch items tends to be in Steam, which will be a single player. But, um, so I don't know if it's just for that, but there's not an on the trial, because I don't know where to put it in the, um, the Gus. You have six, but only three of them are for this map's boss. Yeah, it's stupid, isn't it? Use them as decorations around the, the um, around the building. <laughs> my my forearms are fucking killing me. That's just a mess lately. Right, I think that's enough. Yeah, more than enough. So let's get a saddle for this fella. Yeah, we've unlocked him. Okay. What were the caves like? 
all of the artifacts on the of the islands are on the map yet for useless. Yeah, it's because it's a modded map, isn't it? That we're just giving out free. Fact that like it's it's the two bosses in one as well, and I think I've seen that the bosses are broken on this as well. So we'll have to wait and see. Right, I need more berries. This won't give me loads, but it'll give me more than I can pick up by hand. So let's get a few berries going. Are you on the game now, Death, or are you just chilling? Do you know, I need to find some trilobites as well, get some chitin so I can get a bloody bird. You're on the game, cool. I only went for the free ones, which are in the open, but me and Waffles the few is not too bad. Okay. Have you been underground yet? Right, I'll split all that so I can get some knocks. So we have an alpha on this island, which is a pain. Um, so I'm not good. There's a baby Toto there. I need to remember that if I decide to go for something twice, but didn't explode. Oh, yeah. Um, only when I think to see how big it is. Yeah, on the trailer, they show the set of tops down there, don't they? There's someone flying over. Is it just me and you on the server, Death? Might be a. It's a nice looking RG. See, I've never based here. I've always been based over there. So at some point, I need to go into that side and build there. I just feel like stuck here. Um, yo, Athena D. Is that you, Death? <laughs> So I'm like in real life, you don't want to see people look at I don't know who they are. <laughs> so what's your plans for today on the game then? What have you got to do? Have you found any gigas yet? Right, let's get some gear going. A metal run. Ah, oh, okay. I've been playing Fallout 4 again, because as soon as I watched the show, I was like, I really want to play this game again. Started playing it, like, an hour a day while I was recuperating, while I was off. And then I wanted to get the mod, so I picked it up to cheap the Game of the Year edition on PC. And I was playing it before. So I'm doing a mod called Sim Settlements 2, doing a big mission, and it's bloody glitched. So the only way out of it is to roll back a save, and the only save that's not glitched is the very beginning when I logged on this morning. So I've lost about three hours progress. I was like, oh, you... F <laughs> but apparently on here, it's been rolling back a lot over the weekend and the Trado servers, so it's been messing it up for quite a few people, which is annoying bit unfortunate as well uh, and they all come to me and go can you help pub and I'm like I don't know what to do I just pay for the server and move on right um, so all the metals round the corner but we've got an alpha there um, I don't need any we can go explore around the island and see And become like creatures of habit, uh, creatures of um, what's the word? Not habit. Um, 
opportunity, you know. If we see something, we'll take it. How long are these got left? Two minutes. Do you know when you go into your crafting menu, what do you prefer? Because people, I see people play like this and oh, it's too much, especially like when you're like late game for me and there's like millions of all the engrams unlocked. I have to have it this way so I know where everything is. I can't play the other way. If I need a bunch of metal, a donkey. Yeah, I mean, at the minute, I don't know what to do. Um, oh, is the cartridge on this map? 90 long deep underwater, a bunch of clusters. I do remember there used to be like, there was like a couple of metal mountains. Uh, the car was fun to team actually. Um, still got a minute and a bit. I mean, one of the complaints I heard about this is it just looks like the island. The alpha is... Um, so if you head down here, this way, yeah, I'll come with you. Because I'm just waiting in a minute. Because that'll suit me because I can get some metal in. It is the thing with the game, because you need flyers. And then, I did try Spartal Heim, I didn't play it long, but he banned flyers on that. So it is interesting, like, how would you play the game? Because one of the problems with this game is it does take away a lot from you as soon as you get certain things. So go right, death. Oh, look at that little bastard there, I hate them. Right, he was up here somewhere. Have you got him? Oh, he's, he's bought the cat. Typical. <laughs> Is that it? Have you killed him? Get out of it, you. Right, but at least two and that, I'll do a metal one. I don't know why. I mean, I can't really collect much, but... So it's a safe island to be on. This is the second island. Uh, you know, when you go in the... Um, let's see what's in this little basic one. Um, the only thing you got to worry about on here is some raptors. There's a trude on. Oh, yeah, I'll take the hide. Early game, free hides. The best. Um... There's Terenzinos. I think that's it, really. It's a relatively safe island to be on. Um, right. I got lost. Where's the bloody metal? Yeah, I've gone the wrong way. In fact, how am I high up? The hell? Right, let's get rid of that death. Yeah. So, people watching, what are your thoughts on the centre? Or even ARC in general, ASA, the direction it's gone. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube when I upload it on that, because I will be lazy and just put it on that, um, let me know in that in the comments what you guys are thinking. Um... Is it true? 
Wait, which is the get lost one? It could have been better. The game or um, the center or the drop? I don't know what you're answering to. <laughs> I don't know. What I imagined in my mind was a total rebuild of the game, and we just never got there. Ah, if you thought, oh, it was all prime. Oh, we have to watch out, won't we? We'll take damage off each other. Let's see what he's dropped. I'll take the prime because um, not that I'm going to cook it. I need spoiled meat. Yeah, oh, cheers, man. Thank you. The only thing I miss from playing on, you know, um, like official service was the trading. There used to be like good that, you know, like you get on and like, um, all right, see you later, death. Thanks for that. Enjoy your metal gathering. I think he only gave me those clothes to put me big fat belly away. <laughs> Actually, I haven't unlocked hide. Um, may as well be fully clothed, eh? Stop being a fat disgrace. Do you know what? It always looks, doesn't it, like, um, I thought that was my belly, you know, like the tops just roll back up. The hard gear makes you look like a surf, doesn't it, you know, like from the, um, like, Middle Ages, like, you're like one of them little peasants. Yeah, put it in health. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, all right, I'm going to go up here then because there's no way I've got stuff up here. Let's see what I've got up on this piece. It's a very dark map of a night, I th I'm finding. Don't think I can play on official anymore. Sod that. Yeah, I'll show you my, my terrible build. I don't know what I was thinking here, yeah, right? So, for some reason, I put like the slopes on either corner. And then I just couldn't get it right, you know, um, like to bring in or something, or I think I could have put those there, you know what I mean? I think because like, where have I got it? Oops. Yeah, like see where that's upside down there. I probably could have put that there and have a little line in, but it wasn't what I was going for. And then I realized I couldn't do it. So I just put some pillars in between. And I guess it's like, it looks like a window. Someone will probably get in, but you can't get in as a person. Uh, but it's very, very basic. It's just a barn. I don't... Oh, grab that food. I don't really have much here. Hey, hippo. 
How are you? Right, what have I got up here? Why is it not letting me access that? That's weird. Um, just found metal and crystal close to beach. Who's Uther? Oh, Uther, yeah, God, I haven't seen you for ages. Right, I've got some metal here. I've got metal tools. Suppose now I've got that. I'll, I'll equip these instead. It's just a bit better, isn't it? And uh, not you. So I have metal here. Um, a little crop pot I will never use. If I got a cooking thing in here, I do. Plenty of spoil meat now, that's good. So why can't I access you? We are we it's there. Can't even destroy it. Strange. I'll make another one. Do you know what? I think. If you're in like a like say the inventory of a smithy and you're standing there, I think it should automatically just pull over. You know, if you're making something in your one, or even vice versa, so you don't have to stop. The game might be crashing. Uh, I hope not. Now what's this shit going on out here? You done fucked up, didn't you, lad? <laughs> well, I'll teach you. He's dead, you know. You can calm down, now. Right. Let's get some um, narcos. Have you been on today, Hippo? I know it was having loads of problems last night. It's funny when they, like, I wake up and I put on the Discord and it's like... Game's crashed, it's crashed, it's restarting, it's crashed. Can you help me? I'm stuck. Can you help me? I'm stuck. And I'm like, fuck you, hell. <laughs> By the way, I'm conscious that my voice is fat, but can you hear me and understand me right? Yeah. Correctly, I mean. Can you get, like, is it coming through clear? Thank you. Good to know. It is a little bit sore. Um, right, so we need to put down a new pestle and mortar. Normally I have a table for these things, but... I don't know, Hippo. I was just trying to mess them around. And then um, I was saying before, so I did it that way. I thought, I'll have a slant. And then on this one, I thought, oh, I've got a slant. And I thought, well, how can I fix it then? Because I didn't want a square there and a slant there. Because I kind of wanted it to be, I don't know what I wanted it to be. And then... Um, I mean, because we're all in different tribes now and I don't trust any of you, I could have left the roof off. So I was like, hmm, what can I do? And then I thought, well, if I, leave, if I put these pillars in, just to block people getting in, I mean, flyers might be able to come in. If anyone seems a die more for them or, like, a shoulder pet and throw it, will it go through? Like, um, the monkey will. Uh, but yeah, I think I guess it works as windows, but it's just so dark in here. And, I've chosen not to put mods on, which might be a mistake, because some of the mods just help, don't they? Like, I like when you've got automatic lighting. See, it's very dark in here. 
hard task of getting a B. He should be in the red one, shouldn't he? Here all day waiting for them. Where are you? Whose tribe are you in, Hippo? Are you in a tribe? Right, fabricator. I don't even think I've unlocked the fabricator yet. I didn't realise how high it was. 48 and I am... Um... Oh, 47, I can do it now. I don't have oil or cement and paste, so that was a waste of a point. Um... All right, let's um, let's go explore. We've got some meat. I've got arrows. I've got some things, so we should be okay. I am gonna grab another torch just in case. Actually, before I do that. Let's just put him. Will he fit in there? Nope. <laughs> oh, just to add a bit of a uh, cosmetic touch, I put the pillars all round, and I was going to put them on the top and the bottom as well, but then I got bored and the game crashed and I couldn't be asked. Um, yeah, you're like a throwaway one. You, you're a better one, aren't you? Um, Right, so down here is plant space, which I haven't really looked at. So plant was streaming on Friday, I think it was. Um, one thing, right, and correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't rope ladders used to go right down the bottom? Can you still do K mode on this? Yeah, you can, can't you? Look, the rope ladder's just a normal ladder now. I always thought they were longer. But yeah, plant space down there. A fish seems to be attacking something or they're just flopping about. So plant's got an iguanodon. Floppy, floppy. She's got one of those cats as well. And a raft again. Yeah, can't be asked jumping down there though. Sometimes there's a basilosaurus in here, but it used to always be sharks. But you'll have them floppy fish as well, which are just horrendous. So let us go this way because I can't remember which way I've been round here and then um, we'll just have a little explore on the island see what we can do maybe get off this place do you know what I don't think he's watching the um, the stream so It says hello on stream, but not sure if you're watching. <laughs> Little hint for him to come watch. Okay. Um, 
Right, where have we got Ryan's here then? Is it me? Is the area quite quite flat now as well? One thing though, you know people have been complaining about the map and how it looks and blaming Wildcard, but if you remember, this was delayed because they'd actually outsourced this, I think, to the team that does Arc Mobile. I might be wrong there. I need a drop. And um they weren't happy with the way it looks, so um that's why it was delayed. So I guess the criticism shouldn't really be on wildcard as this is all garbage. Oh shit, this is gonna crash. Yep, I think it's gonna crash. I mean, that ping is ridiculous. You know, 252. And there it goes. I hate this menu screen. <laughs> this is garbage. The contents of the drop being better than my entire house. Well, it was all thatch, wasn't it? It was a white drop. Now, was that the server crashing or was it just my my own connection dropping? Let's have a look. Um, I'll bring the server up. I think it's kicked everyone. It's saying it's up. Yeah, it crashed, didn't it? Um, They really do need to get it sorted. Hence my title, trying to convince myself. It's... Servers restarting. Fuck sakes. Um, yeah, so the whole point of this is... Um, the amount of mist I don't have, like a full camera thing. I've got maybe the... I don't know. So the whole point is... Um, I think they've made too many mistakes on this game. Going with Nitrado gave them... That's another fucking thing, right? So, they need money for Arc 2 and continue the development. Didn't they get, like, a £4 million thing? So, like, Nitrado was exclusive with them. So, where's all this money going? I've always used Nitrado. I think the only time I didn't use Nitrado was... Um, I think on one of the Conans I used a... Um, it was a German one. Can't what's called now. Begin with a G. But, um... So, I've never had issues. But I think the fact that Nitrado was solely responsible for a game that's broken in the first place, I think that's why everyone's hating on it and it's crashing. And they do hide behind the early access. So, you know, it's early access things may go wrong, but... There's other early access games that don't have any of these issues. Do you know what I mean? So I've never once had a crash on, say, seven days to die. I don't think so, here, Paul. I'm not sure. I don't know. I mean, I'm not a lawyer, not on, but it's not really a monopoly. It's just a server provider, isn't it? I guess. If they were the only server provider for every game, that's a monopoly, but... Um, I'm just not sure, is there any other games that only have one provider? Excuse me. Ugh. Do you know what is a health thing, right? I've been watching Beard Meets Food. It's great. And when he's struggling, he has a fizzy drink because the fizzy drinks help with digestion. But fizzy drinks for me, I don't know, because, uh, you know, the acid I suffer with, but... Um, Right, if I refresh that. Right, it's back on. But we just have to wait a minute.
but then it's saying isn't it that there's three people on oh you just can't see that bit sorry it's saying there's three people on but we know it's not um pop with the fresh cut what you mean the hairstyle do you know what i got worried right because you know like because i'm getting older but I used to get a haircut and then it just grows out fast and it's weird now. It takes ages to cut. It's like it takes ages to grow. And then one day it just goes It's weird. But um Yeah, I know it is death. Um let's just wait and see. So I must be locked out because people it's saying there's people on the server and there's not. I know they're not. It's restarted the server. Um just waiting now to see what it's doing. All right, I know, I know this. I know this, this isn't three in the game, but I'm going to try and join. See what it does. Um, I haven't used, oh, I haven't really been on the game, to be honest. I, uh, I'm not buying the new one because I'm not paying any more money than I have. Um, and I haven't seen the shot, but to be honest, I didn't bother taming the, the Gigantor Raptor, and I didn't bother with the, um, well, to be honest, we were playing score just when I got sick, wasn't it? So, oh, where's it put me? Well, that doesn't bounce you back too far, so death might be okay. Um... Have you seen them yet? I, I haven't left this island, to be honest, so... Right, does this mean now I can access this one? Maybe that was a sign anyway. Oh yeah, the fishy things. I helped plant tame them, but... They're annoying. <laughs> Alright, this is one of these things where how far do you commit on the game, isn't it? Do you just keep going for wanters or do you think it's not worth it? Right, I'm just going to drop all of that. Take that. Murder tuna. I watched that under Paris last night. For some reason I'd seen a few articles and was led to believe it's a good film. <laughs> It was okay. Um, there's a few funny bits in it, like... Um, it, it was just a blatant Jaws rip-off, though. Well, actually, it was more of a... Um, a piranha... Oh, sugar, I hate them things. Uh, it was more of a piranha rip-off, if you've seen the film Piranha. Um... Piranha's a great exercise in, like, plot, <laughs> plot moving along. It's basically, uh, spoilers for a 40-year-old film if you haven't seen it, like, but uh, the scriptwriter apparently just drew a river and went plot point, plot point, plot point. It's perfect. It's basically the top of the river. There is a, what's this? One then, but, oh, right, I need some chitons, don't I? I was letting plant kill all these, and I completely forgot that I need to kill them. The uh, so piranha, <laughs> the um, top of the river, there is a research station full of these uh, genetically engineered piranha. They escape, swim downstream, and then there's certain events downstream that they get entangled with. This is like Fallout, I swear, I kill about a million gunners. And then the bodies disappear. Where the fuck are those, like, things? Sounds... It was a rip-off of Jaws, but it's really good. It's like, um... The remake shit, though. Um... Right, what ping am I getting now? 
135 is still high. Yeah, so Piranha, it's like, Piranha scared the crap out of me when I was a kid. To the point where, like, I was having a bath. <laughs> I used to think that they'd come up in the plug hole and get me. Jaws 2 is okay. I, I like Jaws 2. Um, it is just a remake of the first one, like. Um, it's almost like a slasher film, Jaws 2. I'm a bit apprehensive about what to do now because if Gisa crashes again. Favourite film. It's too hard, but do you know what? Right, Jaws. My mum let me watch it when I was like really young. And it used to make me sick. I couldn't get past the first bit. It used to terrify me, and then I was scared of all the other films as well. It used to make me vomit, and um, just the pure fear of it. And then I remember actually finally watching it and thinking, it's like one of the greatest films ever made, because it is a film of two halves, but the whole bit where the hunting it on the, on the box is amazing. Um, yeah, man, I used to puke. I used to just get worked up about it. You know, it's, it's when I'm like 10 and younger, but it used to make me sick. Yeah, I remember like having like a giant Easter egg one year and then watching it. I was in my aunties and then just threw up everywhere. <laughs> and then my brother hated me because he liked the films, but they wouldn't what they wouldn't have it on if I was there. You know what I mean? So, hey, Plume, welcome on in. How are you been? I haven't seen you for a while. Uh, where am I? That's a new island that they've done. And I don't know, are they islands or are they just the background? You fuck off, you. Um, see, there's the evil fairies down there. I'm okay, I'm getting there. Um, I, I, I took a break because I, I, got, I got ill and then... Um, Still not over it, but um, I thought I'll just start easing my way back in. It's just I cannot for the life of me think of a YouTube video. I can do it for plants any day of the week. Plant talks to me and I go, try this, try that. For myself, I haven't got a clue what to do. So I'm just, um, what have I just walked into? Hey, little monkey. Right, I want to test this now. No, don't do that. You fucker. Thanks. Yeah, I mean, my voice always goes, I think that's the inhaler that I have to use, but I lost sight of my right eye. Um, they've ruled out cancer, but I've got some other, like, really rare bad thing going on. That true Don's just waiting for night time, isn't it? Little shit. Um... This is why I hate passive taming. Because no matter what your boosting is, you've got to wait about 10 minutes, haven't you? Yeah, luckily, he ruled out the cancer. Uh, I had to get like a ball marrow and everything. That was horrible, that biopsy. Um, True Don's pure talk. The pricks, death, that's what they are. There's too many pricks in this game. So I, I have a very rare condition called amyloidosis, and uh, basically your body produces proteins, they break down in the body. These ones don't, they're like double proteins, and but they attach to organs and cause organ failure. So I've had them on my skin, they just cut them out, but I've got one on my eye now, so that's why I lost the eyesight. And then, uh, you probably won't pick up on this, but if I lift my eyelid, it's all like red. There's something called the, conjun the conjunctiva. It's like a layer above your eyeball, and that's what's affected. So, um, 
I've got to go to London at the end of the month, full range of tests, make sure it's nowhere else, and then have radiotherapy and hope that I get me full eyesight back. Conjunctive, yeah, something like that. Um, so, but there's a chance I may never get me sight back fully. So at the moment now, if I have my right eye open, I can see the screens. I can see sort of things. Cannot read anything on the chat. It's sort of like, I would probably say about 55% of the eyesight back. But um, yeah, cheers, Seth. Are you ready yet, you little prick? Gonna run off now. Fucking hate these things. Right, can't be asked with that. Um, where am I in this map? So yeah, I mean, it was a relief not having the cancer, obviously. Um, and then once I get all this sorted, just get the treatment plan going and hope for the best. Well, what it'll do is the radiotherapy, that will reduce the size of the amyloid. And then, because what they said was the tear gland is swollen and the, the optical nerve is damaged. So... Hey, hello. If they can reduce that and the swelling goes down, then it should get rid of the nerve damage, theoretically. So that's the hope. And then, um, but yeah, he, he has said that I, um, it can take eighteen months to heal. Is that Tedja? And um, I may never get it back fully because the, the nature of the, the damage was quite severe. All it was, I had a headache for about a week. And then my eye was killing. And um, I remember going, uh, I wasn't sure. I, I was like mostly sitting with my eyes shut because the pain was just too much. And then I went to watch Dune because I wasn't missing that. <laughs> Hey, Marmel. Where's that little swine? And then um, when I come back, I was looking in the air. Uh, the lift in my building's got a great mirror. <laughs> so I was able to, like, you know, um, and my eye was all, like, pink. So I thought, oh, it's conjunctivitis. You know what I mean? I'll just get an appointment with the doctor. And then I woke up the Monty and it was fuzzy, the eye, you know, like in the middle. So the top and bottom of the site was fine. But then the, um, it was all fuzzy. So, and then the appointment was the Tuesday. When I woke up Tuesday, it was gone. It was all black. They said, go straight to the eye hospital. And then as the day wore on, the vision just deteriorated. I couldn't even see a light. And then I didn't even know that my eyelid was open. Because they were like, hey, can you move your thing? And I was like, I don't even know. Uh, I don't know if my eyes actually open. I can't see shit. We've got to get on true dons. So, yeah. So, it was a, it's been a weird few months. At least I'm not French. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what? Watching that under Paris. Like, what's this bit? Oh, I've just got it in a circle. That's plant space. I don't want to go... Uh, there's probably a... Uh... Oh, I don't want to go down there, but I'm going to fall. I'm going to fall. Nope. Um... Why isn't that torch coming on? It's going to kick us again. Fuck. Uh, watch it under Paris, right? There's a shark in the River Seine and there's a big race happening, you know what I mean? And I think they've released it in time for the Olympics, you not know, to tie in with all of that. Uh, this torch isn't coming on, which is kind of worrying. Why is it not letting me have a torch on? Can you not have a torch on while you're on this? Oh, yeah. Um... But, uh, uh, it's if you like shark films, it's okay. It's funny in part. Um, sort of thing, no right. So nowhere they've cleaned up the River Seine, 
and the Olympics just rip off every city going. It's very expensive to run the uh, Olympics. They were saying Beijing is still in debt over it and London is. But the French aren't happy and God love the French, they will protest anything. And apparently Macron is going to swim in the river. So they've organised this protest where they're all going to take a shit. So the river's full of human crap. And they've even worked out a thing where if you can't get to Paris, you can work out in the area if you have a crap at a certain time, it will hit the river when he's in the water. And that, that's the type of pettiness I can get behind. Boom, boom, plum. You actually do, because it's a big thing. The only thing is, it's a Mako shark, and I'm sure they're not man eaters. I have no idea where I am. Oh, yeah, let's see. So, if we go this way. So, plants, if you're watching, there's metal right above you. But it's a Mako shark that looks like a great white, so I'm not too sure there. This isn't the one that killed me before, is it? It not killed me, but it took me out. Right, ping's gone back down to normal. Well, it's still too high. Take that, and yep, yeah, I will take you. Oh no, I won't take you, I've got metal. What am I on about? Your 334 ping, yeah. They just need... This is the issue, so like, where Hippo was saying is a monopoly. What the fuck's that noise? Oh, my shops. My shops are just fantastic, but let's see what he wants. Well, you are raw fish prime and you landlocked your prick. Um, well, it will be in the night, won't he? I didn't, you know, because I don't know what it is. It changes all the time. Um, it's like, what's your favourite song? <coughs> It's like, what's your favourite song? I, I honestly don't know. Um, even top five's too hard, because it's like... I mean, even like, I don't know, it's too hard. Even if you are what's your favourite gangster film, well, you've got Goodfellas, Godfather, Casino. Um, you've got some Jimmy Cagney ones, which are fantastic. Uh, Angels with dirty, dirty faces, but then you're a gangster, and then you think, well, I like I love Miller's Crossing as well. Shit, still still going here. Is it? Um, favorite horror film? I'm not really big on horrors because I'm a big shit house. But I love Evil Dead Two. Exorcist, pretty cool. The Thing, actually The Thing's probably my favourite horror film. Yeah, that can't be good. Get out of here. You love fan footage films? Okay. At the time you could change your favourite film song, but ultimately you usually have a favourite. Well, it, it depends where how old you are and stuff, because when I was younger, I, I absolutely... Oh, that's more than one, isn't it? The farmy. The zoo and the call. Because here was something raptor. Hey, the alpha. Um, see, the fan footage films. You've got Play Witch, obviously. Um, Cannibal Holocaust, which I have never, probably will never watch. Uh, what other ones is there? I haven't seen Wreck. That, that's apparently good. Well, record. But then that was a Spanish film. Or less, Wreck is the Spanish one. And then, because the girl from Texas in the American remake. 
uh, Goonies every day. Well, that's the thing. Play, I mean, when I was younger, it was like... I can't, I can't say how many times I've watched Rocky. can't say how many times I've watched Enter the Dragon, The Goonies. You just get in a pattern, don't you? Where you but kids do it anyway, because I saw my nieces, they used to do it. Like, um, you get obsessed with one thing over and over, don't you? Um, Quarantine, that's the remake, isn't it? You know how many shows of the fan footage films is? I know there's one about a party. I can't remember what that one's called. It's like a teen party, but fan footage. Um... I honestly don't know. It's the films that I'll stop and watch over and over. You know what I mean? If you put a telly on, it's on, you'll watch it. Starship Troopers, love that. Um, Aliens is just one of the best films ever made. I go back and forth between Alien and Aliens, but I think Balls Out, Aliens, probably tops it for me. Probably because I saw it first. Ghost Watch. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that. Um, oh God, what else is the... Um, yeah, I loved Jackie Chan films when I was younger. I used to watch them all the time. Plume, you're from the UK, aren't you? I think you're sort of similar age to me. Years ago, Channel 4 of a Friday night. This when I was a kid. They used to put, like, you know, like, uh, film seasons on. So you get all the Jackie Chan ones from the 80s. Then he'd have all like the creature features. So you'd have the... Uh... Yeah, Ghostwatch got loads of complaints and it terrified people. Um... Like, have you ever watched that Threads, the, the nuclear war one? I've never seen it. But that apparently got banned. It was too scary. But, uh, but yeah, they used to have creature features like all the Godzilla films. They used to have all the B movies on, or like uh, the space. It came from another planet, all that stuff. And then when they got when film four came out, I thought, oh, they'll do the same. This is shit. Film four is pointless. There's films I'd like to go watch again, but I don't. Like the re-release in Seven Samurai as a 4K restoration in the cinema. That'd be good to watch, but. Will I go watch it? Probably not. Um, remember watching... What did I watch? Once Upon a Time in the West, watching that on a cinema is amazing. And Taxi Driver in the cinema is amazing. Remember going to watch that? And like, there's things you, you can watch a film loads on video. But again, I guess it's different now. Because when, when I was growing up, you watch things on VHS and it was all pan and scan and things were cut off and you missed stuff. And you go to pictures and watch it and your eyes open to whole new things. But, um... Yeah. Days Confused. It's a great film, that. It is. Um, I don't know why I don't have a favourite film. I don't even have a favourite game. I used to say this or Evolve, but I fucking hate this game now. <laughs> um, it's, it's so subjective, though. It just really is difficult. What about the rest of chats? Do you have a favourite film? Where the hell am I? Not anymore. No favourite film. Jaws is probably one of my top films. Because it's just amazing. Um, even though it did terrify me when I was younger. You haven't watched a film in, in years. The Strudons on the beach here. Yeah. Was that Raptors? No, it's Tyler. Oh, I can't even tell. It's a very blue map in it of a night. I know I haven't seen the clouds off or not, but I don't think that makes any difference. But um, is it blue wherever you are on the map? I think the things up there, things amazing. Um, 
But... I, I go through, like, I used to go through periods where it was the director that's want to watch, like, John Carpenter's one of my favourite directors. Um, so I'd watch a lot of his stuff. Um, you can't go wrong with Jackie Chan films. Not as modern stuff, that's shite. But, uh, right, he's going to fight me now, aren't he? Um, but Hong Kong cinema in the 80s was superb. If you go back and watch any of them, they're just nuts. Troll Hunt is a great film. Troll was okay as well, actually. Yeah, that's a fan footage Troll Hunter, isn't it? Yeah, I, I like that one. Um, let's get the hide. It too makes me laugh on Ark, oh, really. Early game, you're just picking up every shard of hide and later on you're just lashing tons of it because you can't be ass carrying it. Right, so I'm, this island's new. I've added this into the game. Am I fat or something? Why is this little shit kicking off? Um... Oh, yeah, it's a good film. That surprised me, that one. But when you watch something like Police Story 2, just for action, God, it's amazing, that film, man. Um, Police Story 1 actually as well that's that's um, Police Story 4 was renamed First Strikes they're the 90s ones you still to find a B it's one of them death when you're not looking you'll find it so I think you just need to keep some stuff on yeah just in case Police Academy is quite good, I remember. I used to, that's another one. I used to love that film when I was a kid. Um, and then, and like, two and three. They did get a bit shit after them, though. Um, and then when Guttenberg quit. It's different now. When I was a kid, um, you would... We would watch films over and over and over, you know what I mean? It's like, because you didn't have satellites or not, and you had a VHS. So, like, things like uh, Bloodsport and... Ooh, nice. Is that a fucking blueprint or the normal one? No. Let's grab this. I don't know why anyone wants spear bolts, but I suppose we are, like, on an ocean thing. The, um... oh, it really is difficult, isn't it? See, John Woo films, I got really into them as well. Hard Boiled, if you've never seen Hard Boiled, that's probably one of the best action films ever. What's all that red over there? Oh, I've heard of this, so they've, they've wrecked the... Wait, is that the Volcano Island? I've heard that the volcano island now, it's no longer black and they've got rid of all the burnt trees. So is the Carno island next to it? Is that this one then? Doesn't look the same, does it? The double VHS Bloodsport and Cyborg. Cyborg was great. He had a boss run of films, but then I think I just outgrew him. Carno is a replace with the new Dino. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know, man. I grew up in the 80s and early 90s. That's when I was like kid and teens, and it's just a better time, really. But. You didn't have cool stuff like this. It's just, I don't know, it's just... Um, for those older, did you ever try and, like, get someone to watch a film you loved now and then from then and they just don't get it? I, I showed, like, a mate, The Matrix, and The Matrix was... I mean, it's... If you've watched all those type of films, it's not mind-blowing, but it's a great film. But they just weren't impressed at all. 
And I was like, what? Oh, I love action films. Uh, Ong Bach, watching that, like in my, whenever that come out. And The Raid, if you watch them two films, they're phenomenal. I, I love stunts in films. It's why, like, um, I think I prefer realistic stuff. Like, for me, and, and I know people now, because they're older and, like, they've got more say, the say in the prequels of Star Wars are, like, great. I don't know, they're still shit. It's like, I don't like the idea of Jedi doing big flips because it's like, you, you're breaking the rules of the film. So, in um, in the original, apart from a few jumps that Luke does in Empire, Vader never jumps and Obi-Wan Kenobi's old. So, if he's old, why isn't he jumping like the way Yoda and Count Dooku and all that were in the prequels? That Seagal shit. He had a couple of good films early on, but... He's a joke, isn't he, really? Um, am I getting back home? <laughs> Get the fuck. I tame these and I never want them. Yeah. What was the one where the rob robbers elephant? Is that Warrior King? Or is Warrior King Gongbach? Quite a bit of metal here. And I have no idea where I'm going. There's a game called Sifu, which uh, made me think of that Warrior King. But it's one of them ones, you know, like, where it's, it's, I was tempted to get it, but I am terrible at gaming. And I was only able to play it with keyboard. But the idea is you start young and then you've got to do, you've got to fight your way through things. But every time you die, you get an, you, you age a year. And then so the game becomes more difficult because, you know, like, you've got the limit the physical limitations as well. So you can end up trying to do it as an old man. Do you never watch the... Pro oh, you know. I think there's a Jackie Chan film called The Protector, which I'm not seeing, because that was the American one. But I know he didn't... Wait a minute, does this go straight to car? Am I going in... Oh, I think I'm going towards car, are we? Yeah, it's turn around. Not on this thing. Um... But he hated doing the protector, so he made police story as a response. Which is probably his best film. Big Trouble in Little China, one of my favourites. Fucking love that film. <laughs> Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. Well, listen, there's an 80s film called The Protector as well. Um, for comedies, I, I love people now. I share them, like the Police Squad films and the Airplane films and Police Squad, the um, the show. People keep putting them on Instagram and Leslie Nielsen was a genius. I know he made some naff films later on, but those films were fantastic. I want to jump off, but... Let me go with the pictures to watch Weekends at Bernie's. <laughs> I think I was like 6'3 in school and I was worried that I wouldn't pass for 15. I was like about 13. Because I remember going to watch Boys in the Hood. Hey, Lee. Oh, you might not be watching. Um. Let's go three hundred weight. 
So I'm now I'm level 50, aren't I? 49. What have I unlocked? Do you want to do? Because there's too much shite. Um... Cheap viewers on. I don't need cheap viewers, mate. Yeah, John Cusack. Um... Oh, again. So when I first logged on the center, one of the problems I was having was, and Lee was as well, it, it was pretty much two thirds of the screen. It was just like someone had wiped it. It was, it was all like glitched. And, um, but I updated my driver and that seemed to work it. Team Wolf, Back to the Future, Doc Hollywood, they were all great. John Cusack, Say Anything, Better Off Dead. And then later on in his career, Gross Point Blank, they were all superb. Um, but I loved, like, Weird Science was one of my favourite films. I used to love that, because it's so funny. <laughs> um, look at these little twats. Oh, shit, there's three of them. No. Stay away from me, hoes. Um, I need to go that way, but I don't think I can. So basically, that's just a little tail off that island, isn't it? I don't see the point in that. Right, I'm there. So I'm guessing we should have to swim at the front bit and then go that way, because I want to go back here just for this bit. Um, yeah, let's take the deads off. I don't know if I want to go up top or on the bottom now. I need a flyer. Secret to my success, yeah, I remember that. See, as a kid, Big was a massive one as well. A bachelor party. No, death. There's no way in hell we're getting aberration next month. This one took, what, three months or something after Scorched, or two months? I think the question is, what shite are they going to try and sell us next month or when aberration comes out as well? Because you'll have... And apparently, I, I didn't know, they're doing something with Power Rangers. So I don't know if Power Rangers is an anniversary or like there's something coming out for that. But um, the show thing, I forgot about that. Fletch was superb, love Fletch. Not so much the second one. First one's great. Um, yeah, apparently they're also releasing something else. Which is a, a Power Rangers <coughs> Power Rangers thing uh, on the seventeenth of June, and then some people are saying, "Well, is that going to be free or is that paid?" They think it's skins, but but it looks like they've made it's more like a robotic. It's almost like the Tom Mecha Godzilla in the poster. I, I'm not sure it should do. Does anyone know? Does the map still have Skull Island? Have I just seen a fucking... Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I'm like, have I just seen an alpha and there's a big one right behind me? <laughs> Get to feck. Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, crap. Eat the pego. Yeah, oh, do you know what? I'm covering chat. I didn't realise. Yeah, it does have it. Hey, Zip She, welcome on in. Uh, if you're new, I am Pupcrawler644 and I no, used, normally I'm a YouTuber, but I've just been trying to get on Twitch a bit more. I find um, streaming and chatting is a lot more fun these days than trying to make videos. Um, 
Yeah, hopefully you uh, stick around and enjoy the content. Give me some hints and tips because I, um, I haven't really played as much, although I was going to say, I haven't played as much a a Acer as I, I normally would, but we were talking before in my Discord and I've got like 600 hours on this game. <laughs> but I've barely played on the centre yet. It's been too busy. Played this map and the other day my son involved as I haven't played in ages, but still has some lag problems. Yeah, they all do, I think. Right, which what are you offering now? I used to luck hook prime. Hey Majo. Won't say no to our little moss shops. Love moss shops. Really? That's I've never experienced that. I suppose though, if you're playing on single player with the lag and does it have tethering on that? You know, if you get a save plume, you can join the server. This is running for like three months, so I know you're. You're mine. Um, I know you're PlayStation, aren't you? If you had Xbox, it's free on Xbox, and it's cross-play this server. So um, even if you if you had it on PlayStation, you could play it. <clears throat> there should be enough room. There's twenty slots. Oh, with it being boosted as well, it's higher level slightly. So the max, I think, is a 174, which this little swine behind me is running up. Tied it on split screen, but we were no more than 20 meters away from each other. The, um, I never played on the PlayStation 4. Um, that was more... Why did I get the PlayStation 4? I think during the pandemic, I was bored. And I wanted to play the Spider-Man game. So I bought it second and the PlayStation. Oh, 180 is the max. Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, so I played a bit of God of War, but I never finished it. Uh, I just wanted it for the thing, you know, um, Spider-Man. And then I got PlayStation Plus and Conan was the free game. And I absolutely loved it. <laughs> So I just played that. So the main game I played on that thing was Conan. What have I got in here? Oh yeah, the metal, that's what I wanted, wasn't it? It's too dark, this map. And oh, that's too bright. Um. I need to take all this round the other end soon, but just for now. But I was saying, I was saying earlier in the stream, um, I I gave up Conan. Um, no worries, Death. I, I gave up Conan because they brought out the battle pass to the thought. You stuck on the spot. Where are you? Oh, he's not watching the stream, is he? Um, oh, you little... T I hate them things. Um, uh, yeah, so I thought, Conan, I've bought the game. I've bought the season pass. And then they were releasing the DLC separate. And then they come out and go, we're releasing a battle pass. And I thought, that's shady. I'm not doing it. And then this game, it's like, uh, oh yeah, buy the game, pay for mods, um, buy a Frontier Pack, pay for individual dinos. It's like, fuck off. And they've still got a DLC supposedly coming at the end of the year. So, a graphic glitch making it unplayable. Um, I, I don't think it's... Oh, he's not watching, is he? Um...
Oh, let's see any of these GPUs. Um, with Metal Gear, I played three, three onwards, I think. So three was great. Wait, did I play two? No, because two was the really old one, was it? Um, what's going on? Um, uh, what am I on about? Yeah, so is three the one on the oil rig? Where you're reading. Sons of the Patriots, I think that was the first one, so I played that. Then, um, four, I think you're an old man. The owl noises in the redwoods are cool. And then I really liked five, to be honest. I know that was a bit, um, I think people were a bit unhappy with that one. But I enjoy it. I, I like the open world aspect of it, you know, where like you're just going around and then playing about in uh, Afghanistan and then I think you're in a jungle. Oh, I played three. Sorry. Two is Sons of the Patriot, I think. Then you've got three, which is Snake Eater. Snake Eater was my favourite. That's the Vietnam one. And then four is where you're the old man, I think. Uh Grand Zeros, Grand Zeros, yeah, that was the um, the sort of like demo for five, wasn't it? Apparently, the re the remaster in three. Right, so he's died. Uh, let me see. Normally, he gets stuck or something, so you have to kill him. So if I fast travel over to him. I don't know where he is. Lee Simple Bed. And I didn't play that Death Stranding. Oh, God, look at his face. Right. Oh, is he? Uh, I'm streaming Lee. I can help if you want. No idea where he is. I mean, like in in the game. Let's see. Could not tell you where the hell that is. <laughs> I'm guessing the swamps. Um, that's redwoods, isn't it? But he's there. Okay, so where's his bed in here? Which is timed out. Beds if we go. I always love where, like, you know, when you play a Metal Gear and it's got, like, it's got the pictures there, you know, of the people talking to you, and it's like, Snake! 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 <laughs> So put far, that's plant's hilarious name for my bed. But I want to go with that one. So this one needs to be renamed. The feckin' Pegamastix. Right, I can't get to Lee because... His bed's on a timeout. I'm guessing that's blue. Yeah. This fucking thing. Wait, it steals the Pegamastix. Didn't know they did that. Fight back, you shithouse. I never knew they did that. Fuck off. <laughs> I hate these things. I 
I'm just gonna try and punch its lights out. I think I hate these creatures more than any other creature in Ark, you know. Because at least with a Pegamastix, you can kill it and get your stuff back. But this little bastard rips her off. Um, we beat the islands, yeah, and then... But I just like starting my own character. Um, so most of the ones playing have imported their characters over from Scorched. But I didn't finish Scorched because that's when I got sick. Um, what level is he? So um, I just started a new character on this one. But this one's not a story map, is it? It's just... Um, I think he's going to kill me before I kill him. Yeah, he is. Little bastard. Where was I with my spears? It never used to, but they've added it. Um, because that was the um, the cash grab, wasn't it? The cash grab when they were in trouble. So you always fought the Manticore, but you never actually ascended from it. But they've, uh, I think they've added the ascension now. Why are these fighting? I know you're a decent level. 102 might be good, mightn't it? But I need to get rid of this little swine. Um, follow on. Well, you s in a way, the story's all the lore, isn't it? So you have to go grab all the lore points, but because uh, the story's only there, isn't it? Really? Oh fucking! I mean, good job I'm not asked about these pegamastics, but um. The, um... Well, let's see if I just tame the little twat. <laughs> Get out of the way, you. I'm just gonna pass out. Um, so yeah, I think. Well, the story is thing you, isn't it? It's that me, whatever, and the other characters from the animes that show. Uh, what are they called? Um, this stuff, you know, you've got. It doesn't know because I haven't got any on here. I can't remember the bloody names. Um, See, why show us all this when we haven't even got them in the game? It's just, it's the same code. Just pasted over, isn't it, really? Wasn't that a crypod in that bag on the beach? Oh, no. So what they did is... Oh, I think it's going to kick me. Um, I haven't seen one of these little swines for a while. Uh, fuck's sakes. The um, the problem with this now, there's paid DLC creatures. But you know what you'd think? They'd only appear if you'd um, bought them. They're on the game. 
but you just can't interact with them. So on Scorched, you got that big flying thing, and that revives dinos. So if your dino dies, you get the essence of it. Why is it not stopped? Um, so you get the essence of it, and then you can bring it back to life. I never paid for it. I can see it on the game. And then this shadow main reskin. I can see it. I don't think I can kill it. I'm not sure if it can kill me. But uh, in the wild. But um, it's on the game. It's fucking stupid. Right, this is not stopping. Why is it not quitting? Hmm, I can hear it, but... Has it kicked anyone else? Get the old task manager out. Kill this stupid ass game. Right. Um. Okay, you're still good. It might just be the game then, might you? You died trying to tame the bee. Passive teams, aren't they? Pain in the ass. Let's see if I can get this loaded up again. I still think that was more frustrating in the early days of Ark when you're on Xbox and you just get kicked to the homepage, eh, to the dashboard. That was a bloody pain every time. And you know, going back to favourite, I don't even think I've got a favourite band. I used to say Faith No More, but... Um, I go through periods where... Uh, listen, I, I still like you too. I know everyone thinks, oh, it's cool to slag them off, but they had some great albums. ACTC, superb band. Sure, they all sound the same, but whew. Um, Metallica, uh, Metallica up to Metallica Black. Anything after that, shite. Um, Who else do I like? I prefer early Chili Peppers to now. I don't listen to them now, but even like... Like the best album is Blood Sugar Sex Magic. Uh, Mother's Milk was a good album. Californication was an okay album. For me, it's like, I mean, I've seen a picture of it as well when you see it for people my age. Um, it's like in the space of eight months, these albums are all released and it's just a phenomenal range of albums. It's one of the best years in 92 or 93. I think you had Nirvana, Pearl Jam, Chili Peppers. I think Pantera as well. God, so it was just... just Maybe Rage Against the Machine was in there as well. Well, right, let's see if I'm getting back on. How the fuck did... Oh, I was dying anyway, wasn't I? Right. Where's my bird? Has this roll me back? Didn't I rename the bed? Oh, <laughs> God, I can't even see it. Idiot. 
I'm gonna guess Guns N' Roses. But they came out with two albums. Hmm. Who else was 93? But then actually, no, it wasn't 93. Wu-Tang Clan, ah. Was that the um, 36 Chambers? Get all my stuff. Hopefully that bloody pelican is dead. Ready, let's see if this fat belly flops. <laughs> Probably should do make some food. Wait, am I not cooking that metal yet? Slacking off. Yeah, I am. Um, first proper album I bought for myself was Appetite for Destruction, Guns N' Roses. Um, lost the bait. I hate, I hate Tame and Bees, mate. Um, and I had the old bands cover where it was the robots, the demon jumping over it and the girl with the knickers down. And then, um, and then over the period of the next few years, I got heavier and heavier in my tastes. Um, dabbled with a bit of death metal. And I liked it, but now I look I listen to it and I think, God, this is fucking awful. I don't like the metal with the uh, you know, voice anymore. I just can't stand it. Um, I think I prefer hard rock. <laughs> yeah, so this thing, Plume, is that's the soul of it, the essence, and you can revive it with the Oasis, or, which is not on this map. So why on earth have they brought up? Ping 154, I'm running slow. Wait, where's my gear? There it is. Nineteen. Do you know what? I haven't been bothering with this. Let's see if I actually change. Take the clouds off. Does that give me a frame jump? It winds me up that I have to take things off to play the game when it's like optimize your game for fuck's sakes. You know what I mean? It's like it shouldn't have to be this way where you know uh, just to get like. It, it should be a guaranteed 60 frames, no matter what. I know, like, consoles get 30, but... I don't think you notice it on console, because console players aren't really bellends the way some PC players are. You know, with all that... You're only getting 30 frames. It's like, well, you're playing on a fucking TV. You're not that ass. You haven't got, like, a 240 hertz monitor or whatever. You pleb. Um but this shit, you know, it's on a PC, don't you? Because it's a little cheeky, 25 frames. Right, come on, Chunk, get up the rock. Ah, I don't think I can do that. Right, I want a bird. All right, death. So there's blue over there. Redwoods is behind. Is that gorilla statue thing still over there then? They used to loom over the, um, 
over the redwoods. Alright, 19 frames. Why the fuck is the plane so shit? Right, Terrazon. I'm gonna go for this if it's over 100. 102. I mean, it's not max level, but I just need one to start me off. Ah, the way you. Eyeball. <laughs> Wasn't sure how to get this game as it might not look good on an old TV that's not 4K. Um, to be honest, I don't think they play well. I've got the Xbox Series S. I didn't even notice if it's in 4K and I'm playing on games, but, but I play a lot of games on the Xbox as well, so they're not 4K. Um, but... I think it'll be fine, really. It's just, uh, as you know, like, uh, youngins about. I think that poo ate that then. Did you hear the little noise it made when it popped it out? Right, Dodos, please tell me you have little prime machines about. Uh, 180 on this one. I bumped it up a bit. To be honest, when we were playing, uh, we were playing a mod of map in between the uh, islands and Scorched, and uh, just to make a bit of interest. Oh no, I think that map had higher levels and the people liked it, so we we, um, we whacked them back up to 180. But then, when you do that, you've got to like work out, you know, you breeding and all that, which is a bit of a pain. Because Beacon now, you have to pay for it to do it. It's like, I'm not doing that. So it's a bit of trial. I think I'm just going to have to use meat. I don't know why your body drops a bag, even though there's not on any. Right, you don't need a 102 anyway, but... Right. So sorry it's all jerky, it's just not playing well for me either, to be honest. Um, right, I've took the clouds off. What was the other thing you used to say? Oh, do you know what? It might be the water settings and stuff. I haven't played around with this for ages. I mean, I am using a... Um, I'm playing it in 1440p. <laughs> so I suppose I would drop that off, but motion blur, turn that off. Um... Pretty much everything's turned off, isn't it? Um, I can try quality on the DLS. Let's try that. Hey, Christian. You tried playing yesterday and crashed your PC. You've got like a boss PC. Haven't you got like a 3090 or something now? That's just not helped at all, that has it. I mean, on the PC, I've got open Chrome so I can see Twitch. I don't know, I've got Discord open, um, OBS, camera, Steam Deck, even though I'm not using it in the game. So. Oh, I thought you'd got a new one. So you got a 3070 as well. Um, 
Yeah, uh, uh, Lee, Lee jumped on before and he was having graphical issues. So when I first started playing, it looked like, you know, like uh, the game had crashed and stuck, you know, like get all the lines. What's this running? These are really territorial about their babies, these things, which means there's a baby about actually. Come on, my chefs, let's go get some prime. Sorry, kid. <laughs> Your mum doesn't know what's happening to you. Yeah, I mean, it's battling everyone, isn't it? Yeah, you better run. Oh, I thought you'd set up a new one. My mistake. Yeah, you know, oh, what are you following? Oh, I fucking hate when this does this. Um, yeah, it's funny because I was going to buy the 4070. Uh, there was a 4070 Ti Super for like 650, and I was like, that's really tempting. And then when I lost sight in the eye, I thought, thank God I never did that. <laughs> What a waste of money that uh, what a waste of money that would have been. Once I get healed, I'll reward myself. So is the camera running slow as well? It looks at an OBS. Someone's pulling resources, isn't it? So look, we got a sensor is using like 10. I'm not using all my memory. <coughs> CPU is 55%. So that's fine. So why is it running slow? <coughs> GPU 97, which you'd expect. Do you know what? It's that in it. It's the, um, the VRAM. I'm nearly using all of it. Which I believe the 40 series has better VRAM, even though it's less than AMD. <coughs> With all the features they've got. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, I've gone up to 50. No, back down to 21. Game's a piece of shit. All right. Um. Do you know what? I should have put chat on the screen because I'm... Oh, I left this up top. I think I've left it all in the top piece. Um, I was going to say... Completely forgot what I was going to say, you know? Here we go. Well, I've left it all the chitin up top unless it's in this parasol. 82. I don't think that's enough. But we'll see. Um, oh, maybe. Do you know what? Now I've got this. We can go for a little explore. I'll be honest, I get a PT just so I can get an RG. <laughs> but I'm just not quite there. I don't mind this though, like the slow T, you know. I did put a tight, you know, convince me this game's still good, but no, actually, I think it helps that I'm chilling out talking to you guys. You know what I mean? I think it's better that way now. Um, sometimes when I log on, I'm just like, what do I need to do? And I just can't be bothered.
Right, you will not be able to carry my fat butt with all the crap I've got on it. 16 frames. It might be dangerous flying, so we'll have to wait and see, but let's dump all of this in here. Do you know what? Only 94. 90 pings, fine. I just don't know why what's happening with the frames. And I've put the saddle away, haven't I? Like a divvy. Did I put the saddle on there? Oh, this is unplayable. All right, that TLS didn't work. Maybe it's this island. I'm gonna fly over to the mainland just to have a little scout about. I might die, I might not. So in fact, um, I'm going to leave my decent pick, I think. I mean, you can always get another one in a drop, but it's just, if you can leave it, you leave it, you know what I mean? If I see something cool, I might tame it, but I've got no way of bringing it back, so... Oh my god, but I'm just wondering if I get off this beach, will it play better? So let's go, let's go over here to this little island. Right, what have we got on here? 12 frames, man. Oh yeah, I've left the display captured on so you guys can see, can't you? The, uh, where's my camera going off? What the fuck's going on? <laughs> I've just seen the camera flash on and off. Hmm. I mean... Oh, so now the encoder's overloaded on OBS. Why? Nothing's changed. I never understand this with OBS, and hopefully the stream's still playing. But, um... Nothing's changed, so why is encoder overloading? When I've been streaming, what, two hours now? Now everything's going funny. It makes no sense to me. So there's another resource getting pulled. But, um, do you know what? It's unplayable. Um, I think two hours. Uh, I could have gone for longer. I might come back, but I'm hungry. And I think for now... Right, main thing. I've got myself a pterodon. All right, Plume, see you later, man. Yeah, I'm glad you... Uh, it's good chatting to you as well. It's been a while. Um, I didn't stream on YouTube because you couldn't be bothered setting a thumbnail up. All right, you stay there, sunshine. And... Um, 
Yeah, guys, with everything playing up on that, I think this is a great time to end the stream. So thank you, everyone, for um, coming in, saying hi, and stuff like that. Um, let's get this display capture off. Yeah, so um, have yourselves a great day, great evening. I'm going to get some food. I'm starving. And see you later. Bye-bye.